welcome back to Bun Smashing. I am the best chauffeur in the world. The best. Sure you are. The absolute. Only 7% of the players got that achievement. Welcome, sir. 7.46%. What you got to say? LAPD detectives. We're here to speak to Henry Arnett. Oh. Uh, or his fiance could just show us where the apartment uh, is. Like, let's uh, cut the bull. You can take the lift. You can take the lift. I was already taking the lift, you bitch. Or you could have just asked the fiance who went with us. Yeah, true. <laughs> that, that is that is actually a good question. Like, why? Well, isn't this just nice and awkward? Yeah, way to fill up the awkward silence with awkward talking, Roy. I didn't even say anything about Roy today. I didn't say a damn thing. No, nah, that's me saying it. I don't like people who just like in incessantly chatter at elevators. Because it's like, it's a confined space. Oh, Ooh, shit. Shit. It's a confined space and I can't escape. Put your hands in the air. Really, Roy? Now if you, you really want to party with me? Now you don't want to shoot people, Roy? Really? Let me see yeah. this is what you got for me. Just Put all your hands where our eyes can see. Where'd he go? Really? Did he really climb up here? God damn it. Oh, God damn it. This plank ass bullshit. Be careful. Stop or I will shoot. Just be careful. All right, we did it. Yay, good job. All right, watch out. Oh, oh, you motherfucker. You monkey fucker. <laughs> Who the fuck is this? No, oh, that's that's. Oh. Really packs a wallop. Can I get back here? Under your own steam, miraculously, he came in through the window, said hello, and then keeled over. How was our net? He's coming around too. He's all hopped up. Good time to get some answers. Yeah. Let's do that. Where's the piece of shit we chased? He knocked us out. Wow. All right. Before we do all that, let's do some investigation. Okay, do some investigation. No, I didn't say investigation. I said guashin. That's not. That's not a thing. It's a thing because I said it's a thing. No, it's not. Much help. <sighs> How do you know it's not much you help? You point out the obvious. You know that. How do you know it's not much help, there, Phelps? This is a very nice apartment, though. Yeah. So, like, is this is this technically considered a study or a rumpus room? Um, probably both. Um, that would be... Okay. Okay. Is there anything else? What is that, a tea bag? Nope. Nope. Okay. It might be. Can you look at the shirt? Nope. Oh, okay. looking at the shirt. Wait, is there an open? What was that? Nope. No, it's a mirror. I nice. Like, I like when mirrors show my reflection. Yeah. Uh. When will my reflection show who I am inside? Inside. What's in the flashlight? It's a chunky ass flashlight. Dental. Anything <coughs> else? Why is there cut up watermelon just there? I mean, I want some watermelon right about now. But why is it just... That's, like, gonna dry out. You got a good point. There you go. Suitcase going somewhere? Who is this? Chase. Chase? What? Chase our debt. No. You told oh. Heather you're honeymooning without her? What? Yeah, Arnett. Chase Arnett out through the window down the stage. Oh, my God. That's not... Oh, my God. And then interview Mr. Arnett. Oh. Wow. What? His name is Chase Arnett. It's like Wyatt Arnett or some shit like that. Oh, okay. Well, you know what? That's what it says. Chase it says is an chase. action. Well, then they shouldn't have put it in capital letters. And also, that's not the person we were chasing. But that's what it says. Chase Arnett. I know what it says. Okay. I'm telling you that it's wrong. With your wrong ass. Okay, well, you're telling the game they're wrong, not me. Because I didn't make the game. So, yeah. That's that. Let's have a conversation. 
Let's have a night. Let's have a conversation. Roy, how about you let the grown-ups talk and you go outside and, I don't know, do some actual detective work? Yeah, true. That'd be nice. So that's a lie. Um, yeah. You're lying, Henry. Yeah, come on, Henry. <coughs> Henry Arnett. Let's see. The Fabergé egg. Click, 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 egg with the Fabergé cigarette case. Because you pawned a Fabergé cigarette case today for $600, a case that is on a list of stolen items. It was yeah. Julia's idea. Get a list of society parties and find out where and when and then have the guests for it. Now that makes sense. Miss Julia! Oh! How much roommate she always wanted more. Look at her expression. There's no reason for you to look flabbergasted, sweetheart. Your fiance threw your ass under the bus. Like the, the, the gaping mouth, like, ha oh, oh, ha oh. ha. She'd have married Heather if she had her. Julia told the others that, that they were <coughs> that she was going to create a, a new gang. Oh, Julia. I don't believe you because we just saw. Yeah, that's a lie. Not only are you throwing your fiance under the bus, you're lying on her now. Wow. No, no, that's not the fiance he's talking about. Oh, uh, whatever. Look at look at you just making accusations and shit. That's like, Heather. Julia's the dead girl. Right. Julia's the dead girl. Wow. Shut up. Uh. You pet train ticket. Thank you. Welcome. No, I, I really did because I was about to be like, holy shit, did I actually get the trade ticket in the evidence? Tell me it isn't true. <laughs> oh, it's true. I wanted to marry Heather. I told Julia I wanted out and she laughed in my face. So did you kill her? To pay Willie and Jimmy a fortune to do her, and now I'm completely broke. What you are, Buster, is under arrest. Yeah. Because that's murder. Who is Sir. Henderson? What is it Whoa. Conspiracy you know. to commit murder. Because he didn't technically kill her. No, but you hired somebody to kill her, yeah. which still is first degree murder for you. No yeah. That's a lie. That is that's a, a that's a lie. Ass lie. And you know what we do with liars? Jacou Jacques. You added an extra ock in there. I did. We Jacou's no, Jacques. No, it's, because I told you it's simply when just, you say no no no. When you say Jacou's for some reason, it makes me think of Jacques from Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. I don't know why, but it does. So now it's we Jacques. <coughs> I'm not saying that. All well, fine, saying I'll is, say it. You don't have to. I didn't say you had to adopt the thing. Jacques. 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 See? There you no, go. no, you can't step on my thing. I didn't step on your thing. You are stepping on my no, thing. I helped you. It's not helping me. It's Contraband list. Thing. Your first burglary was a Dr. Harold Stoneman. You want to explain how he is involved in show? Yeah. Henderson is Stoneman. He was crazy about Julia. She could get him to do whatever she wished. He threw the parties, and we arranged the burglaries. Julia never let him touch her. She just kept him hanging. <coughs> wow. I hate having this cough right now. I know. It's, okay. it's the worst. Henry Arnett, you are under arrest for burglary and for the murder of Julia Randall. Henderson is stoned me, right? I'm not the guy you want. Go talk to the uh, We are. You just but you said. Still admit it to you just said you hired a fortune for these guys to take care of her. Yeah. That's conspiracy co to commit first degree murder, yeah. which means you committed first degree murder. What? How is that slow for you to understand? Well, I mean, like. No, no. He's an idiot. Mm. He's an idiot. Huh. Really? Yeah, I was just trying to see how much further we had on this case. Not very much further. Yeah, that's why we're going to finish this and call we it a D-A-Y. Yeah. <laughs> now I have to worry about... I guess the wedding's off. He only robbed her mother and killed her best friend. Cut the guy some slack. So how does the wow. fit in? That's what we're about. And that's that's not a piece of shit. Oh, he's a very he's a big piece of shit. That's nice and insensitive of you to say, you fucker Roy. Back in there like a drunk 
You're welcome, Dave. <coughs> yeah, you know what? Yeah. Yeah, I got the sirens on so you can get the fuck out the way. Or just nope. run it and everything and make Roy go through the window. That'd be fantastic. I don't know if I can make him do that. You can't make him go through the windshield? Honestly, I'm trying to think about like the, yeah, the, the first game that I ever played that actually allowed you to do that if you drove fast enough. I think it was GTA 4. Was it? Why didn't they include that? God damn it, it did, Roy. It did not. Just go through the fucking windshield, Roy. It did not trigger. Why did it not trigger? Why did it not trigger? It's still not triggering. Just get out the car. Fuck yeah. it. Fuck it. It's going to look. Oh, wow. It's going to literally make you. There it goes. Usually it triggers. But yeah, no, uh, like GTA 4, I think was the first game that I played uh, that was kind of sort of open world by Rockstar. So the same company that made this, um, where like if you drove fast enough and hit uh, hit a wall or hit another car, you could rocket yourself through the windshield. Ah. Hang on a moment, sister. Don't say tell shit. Henry Arnett and tell him it's urgent. I can't do that. You tell can. Him. You fucking will. I'm not in the goddamn mood. It's late at night, lady. Yeah, it is kind of late at night, and I'm not in the mood. I'm afraid Mr. Arnett is here to see you, and he says it's urgent. Send him in. <laughs> that sounds different. I told you never to come. Tell us the truth, doctor. Yeah, doctor. Because you were getting ready to shoot Arnett, weren't you? He's about to talk some shit. Prison Are you? Will you testify in court that they <coughs> with these robbers? They organized the robberies. Julie would get the names of the guests attending my wife's parties. Didn't matter how much money I showered upon her, it was never enough. Wow. Well, that makes sense because her apartment was very nice. Never really cared for me. Doctor it's a shame, though. Her hands look so weird against her mouth. They do. The practice. You'll call Dr. Gerard. No, 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 no. Please don't cry. <laughs> I can't even laugh, but that's an ugly ass cry right there. That was an ugly cry. Lock me up and throw away the key. What have I done? Yo! What the absolute That was a delayed scream. And then that short scream, like, ah, poof. Ah! Yeah, Roy, that's your fault. Because you're a dick. I mean, like, I don't know why he would say it's his fault. It's not like he knew he was going to jump out the thing. It's Roy's fault. Everything is Roy's fault. You know what? Fuck it. I'll just take it. I need an ambulance on the corner immediately. The offices of Dr. <coughs> 1646 Iver Street, Hollywood. Really? I didn't do that. Really? I did not do that. Really? On our way. This is why you need to leave shit well enough I alone. I was trying to help you. Let's try and wrap this up. Then. Being all touchy touchy on everything. All right, hold on one second. There it is, right there. Jesus Christmas. Just the worst. Worst. The, where, where the fuck do I get out of here? The worst. The worst. We gotta go to Willie's or Wiley's. <coughs> Whoever he is. Wiley. Whatever. This isn't Mega Man D. I don't care. Really Sorry we're coughing so much. We like <sighs> trying to get past her asthma and my weird cold. Yeah. Oh wow. 
<laughs> wow. Yes. Oh, Lord. He didn't really fall that far, though. He didn't, but he. I mean that. I yeah. mean that was like a far fall, but not that far. I've seen stuntmen fall farther, but not die. Look out! Oh, it's literally just down the street. Roy, did you just raise your fucking voice to me? Is that what you just did? Did you just raise your voice to me? No, I want to know. I want to know right now. Because I will fuck you up. <coughs> We're about to fuck it somebody up. It is one else. in the fucking morning. Don't raise your voice to me, Roy. He's around Don't raise your voice somewhere. to me. A big guy. Telling you right now. Say he always wears basketball shoes and a cream jacket. What do basketball shoes look like in the forties? I, I don't. Find the game well and have the commander set up a drag net. We want the Siri. What do basketball shoes oh look like God, in the forties? Oh my God! Really? They're high tops. Oh Jesus Christ! There you go. Just keep your eyes open and your mouth shut. Oh, oh, oh so, no! I don't think those are them. Those look like regular ass converses. I don't That's they, what they're saying. I don't think I don't think they made converses yet. Siri, when were converses uh, developed? Nineteen oh eight. Really? Mm -hmm. Founded in nineteen oh eight, it has been a subsidiary of Nike Inc. Since 2003. Oh, yeah, that I did know. So, yeah. That's that's your sneakers for huh. the 40s. You're welcome. Aren't you glad you got a sister who's, like, well, you know, willing to research shit? Like, you dog her out at the same time? I mean, you could have just typed it in instead of actually speaking out to Siri. I wanted to talk to Siri. I felt lonely. lonely. So I talked well, to Siri. I'm here. But you're being mean. Being mean. You are being very mean. Not being mean. You are. Being incredibly like. No, no, you're not. You're me. I, I, I'm the one who asked you to look for me. No, you did not. I did. I literally did. What are you talking you about? Not. You said don't ask Siri. I said don't That's ask Siri. Being me. The Siri can eat butts. Where are we? Where did he go? Upstairs. Okay. Siri can eat butts. I think that's just rude. I mean, you were talking about white. Super gluing and gorilla gluing butts. Uh, Roy's ass, actually. So if you're gonna say it, we're gonna say it correctly. <coughs> oh, <coughs> Jesus, dude. It's way too, way too late in the day to be doing it is, this. It is. It's way too late in the night. It's it's past one o'clock. <coughs> it's like, dude, it's. He's gotta be around here somewhere. No place to go unless. Now you get an achievement if you shoot out all the letters in Broadway. Start from the top. Oh, nice. I think that killed him. Oh, I thought he did. Careful. There we go. And just kill him. There's the achievement. And we go later. There you go. He's dead. Son of a bitch really picked this spot for it up here, didn't he? Yay. Yay. Get these achievements. Kennedy's folks are flying in from New York tomorrow to claim the body. I saw her on the slab. So perfect. Looked like she was made of porcelain. Okay, that's a creepy way to talk about a dead body. Yeah, that is. Leah had that impact on a lot of them. Christ, it's cold. You guys did good work here today. Did we or did I? Because to be quite honest, Roy didn't do a goddamn thing. That's very generous of you, Lieutenant. I mean, yeah. <coughs> oh, Jesus. There you go. There goes that achievement. Yay! Oh, completed the Naked City. And there we go. Four stars. And that's a good place to stop for the night. That is right. multiple cases done. A little bit of damage, $3,000 worth, but it's okay because we handled our business. We killed the killers. We arrested the 
one guy that did it because the other guy that was going to get arrested decided to do a swan dive out of his office. Yeah, he did. For no reason. Yeah. So we'll continue more of this because we got like, what, a couple more cases in advice and uh, arson? I think so. Yeah. Yeah, so we do. we'll yep. catch y'all later. Deuces. Bye.